Get ready. Hey guys, it's Brett here, and I'm so excited to walk you through this overview of the new Outliner FX. Outliner FX is a free update to my original Outliner product, which was just a simple single um, effect. But Outliner FX is a whole tool set full of outline effects and custom shapes and shape effects. It's got so much in here, I don't even know where to start. I really think you're going to like it. All right, so after installation, you will find Outliner Effects in two places. First, over here in the Effects Browser, under Bread Effects Outliner Effects, you'll first find the Outliner Effect, um, which has all the classic fills and um, textures that you're used to in the original Outliner, plus five new outline styles and some new features such as position offsets, wiggle, and trace mode. Okay, and so down below here, you'll find effects specific to each of the new outline styles. Um, we have one for uh, electric, one for extrude, um, one for your basic line, um, neon, and over here we have rough. So each one of these specific outline style effects is going to give you more controls, more options that are unique to that specific look. And over here we have a sixth uh, plugin called Radiate. Radiate is kind of its own thing. It emits uh, radiating waves of your outline, I guess. And it's more focused on the controls for the radiating effect, but you can choose any of the new five outline styles from within the plugin itself. And you may notice we have 4K and HD versions of each one of these. Um, that's because the way Final Cut and Motion handle some of the filters we're using, um, you will get a sharper, a better result if you use a 4K plugin um, in a 4K timeline and an HD plugin in an HD timeline. You can mix and match all you want, but the best results will be to use the ones specific to your resolution. The 4K ones take a little bit more processing power, take a little bit longer to render, but they will give you the better result in a 4K timeline. Okay, so all the aforementioned effects down here in the uh, effects browser can be applied to any clip with transparency. Uh, it could be something with an alpha channel like our, like our model here, um, or it could be something that was green screened out or even, you know, an icon or a logo or text. Anything with transparency can have one of the outline effects applied to it. But what if you don't have any transparency or what if you just want to kind of like draw your own shape? That's where the new custom shape effects come in. Over here in the titles browser under bread effects, outliner effects, you'll find all these unique custom shapes, uh, custom shape effects. I think there's about 40 of them in here total with all of them. You can draw your own shape with either a six point or a 12 point outline, like the custom shape here. Um, you can blur and colorize the inside and the outside of your path and all of them you can apply the five different outline styles. Okay, so not only can you draw your own shape on, but next over here we have a magnify effect which enlarges the um, interior of your path there, kind of like a magnifying glass. And radiate, which is very much like uh, the radiate effect in the uh, effects browser. And then we have these custom tracer effects, which animate just a portion, as you can see, of, uh, of your path. And the custom rectangle tracer here is specific to just a rectangle shape. It's only got four points, but I made it so it's easier to put around, say, text or a title or something like that. All right, so that is a lot. Wow, uh, so much for a quick little overview, huh?